Important announcement. If you recently updated your Ultimate Nag 52 controller on the latest dev firmware, or when this releases the latest main firmware, and you come to turn your car on, you may notice that there's an F here saying there's a fault with the TCU. And if you listen carefully, it's beeping in a certain sequence. Don't worry, this is very easily fixable, but it does require a one-time configuration once you update the controller. To do this, simply connect up to your TCU as usual in the config app, and you will also see if you go, go to the log view, you will see this saying calibration, no EGS calibration, cannot start TCM. This is absolutely fine. Essentially, in the latest firmware, we're now re including calibrations from the OEM EGS 51, 52, and 53 module, and without those calibrations being set, the TCU will not start since there's some crucial data on there which we grab from the OEM modules, which is not available. So it doesn't know what to do, so for now we have this fail-safe mode where you cannot start the car, you can't do anything. So to do this, we can go to Configure Vehicle or Gearbox, or it's straight here, Configure EGS Compatibility Data. So I will go here and show you where that is. Read Configuration. And here it is again, configure EGS compatibility data. We click this, we now have this very, very big menu. Um, I will be adding more data to this over time since there's a lot more stuff that I still need to reverse engineer on the EGS modules. But you see up here, there are three faults found, hydraulic calibration not found, mechanical calibration not found, and torque converter property calibration not found. So for me, I know I'm in a 2.11.076, which is the E55 AMG. So I'll filter by chassis to 11. 0 0.076 and you see here I have a bunch of listed calibrations from for the E55 AMG and you'll see there's some variation in them and for me I know that my original controller on this car ended in 1432 so that would be this one here because you can see the original EGS part number two so all I have to do is to click apply and then I get this little window here and I can select use the hydraulic calibration from this TCU use the mechanical calibration, and use a torque converter calibration. And then, all I have to do is hit apply calibration, and the TC will reboot, and we're back to normal. I can start the car as normal now. And everything is absolutely happy. So that's pretty much it as to how to fix this. I will obviously document this on the wiki in images format, so you guys can easily understand um, as a step-by-step -step guide how to do this, but that'll be it for this video. If you have any more questions, feel free to notify the Telegram discussion group or leave a comment. If your TCU is not found in the EGS calibration um, compatibility data, please leave a message somewhere to say so because we're trying to find as many EGS flash files as possible so that I can get as much calibration from as many TCUs as possible. So that'll be it. So see you guys all in another video. Bye.